welcome back everyone so today in this video i will be explaining that how to disable game bar presence writer game dvr completely from your windows 10 and windows 11. now if you're not sure what exactly the game bar presence writer is so this is basically a feature that is used for the xbox for the recording and majority of the people they do not use it but it's still it run in the background even if you disable it from the setting but why you should disable it so the major reasons are that it take a lot of bandwidth lots of cpu and the memory usage and it eat a lot of frame rate and drop down the fps and even the lagging issues can occur because of the game bar presence writer file it, now what you have to do first you need to make a right click on the windows icon then you have to click on settings in this setting you have to look for the gaming option and here you will find xbox game bar so click on it disable it from here now disabling from here it will not be completely disabling it but this is the first step that you have to apply once it's been disabled close it click on your windows search type xbox game bar click on it click on the setting gear icon at the right and top then click on general and disable both this option of show tips and remember this is a game uncheck it then from the left in menu option only click on capturing uncheck both these two options and in audio to record select to none once you are done from here you can close it now next you will be getting a file in the description you have to download it so this is for disabling the game bar presence writer so click on download then choose the standard download and once it will be downloaded it will be downloaded in a zip file so right click on it choose extract all choose the location wherever you want to extract then click on extract once extracted this kind of file will be coming up open it and here you will find two different file of the registry so click on the first one that says disable xbox game monitoring make a double click on it click on run click on yes yes and ok and do the same with the second one that says disable game dvr and game bar click on it run it yes yes and ok now once you have ran this file close everything now next you have to click on your windows search type reg -E it then from the suggestion click on registry editor click on yes the registry editor will be up now here from the left in menu option double click on hk local machine then double click on the software and then you have to look for the microsoft make a double click on it and in microsoft you have to look for windows runtime so scroll down to the w section until you find the windows runtime here it is once you get it make a double click on it again and then you will find activatable class id double click on it and in this section you have to look for a file that is start with windows.gaming.gamebar all right so keep scrolling down to the w section and once you come to the windows you have to look for the windows.gaming and here on the very top that says windows.gaming.gamebar.presence server you have to look for this one so once you get it click on it and then on the right hand side you have to look for the activation type so basically we have to disable it by making a double click on it and choosing the value data from 1 to 0 but right now you might not have the permission to disable it so if i type 0 and click on ok so it says cannot edit activation type so what we have to do here we have to give the enough permission to our user account so that we can make the changes here so for that right click on this windows.gaming then click on permissions click on advanced a new box will be up here on the top you have to click on change now you have to add the user account of the administrator so to find that click on your windows icon then click on your profile icon click change account settings and this will show your administrator account okay so it can be your microsoft account it can be your local account so whichever it is just copy that and go back to this box type the same name on this box here then click on check names 
this user account will be automatically detected and underlined once done click on ok and now you can see the ownership has been changed and now again click on add then click on select a principal again type the same admin account name click on check names click on ok once added in the basic permission you have to give the full control then click on ok click on apply click on ok and click on ok again all right so we have successfully given the permission now at this time if i make a double click on the activation type and change the value data from one to zero it will be done all right so that's it now you're all done and the game dvr has been completely disabled from your windows 10 and 11 and it won't be running in the background and because of which there will be a less cpu and the memory usage and you will be getting more fps and the best performance for your computer and for the gaming so that's all guys hopefully you will find this video helpful and you should disable the game dvr right now completely to get the best performance and if you found this video helpful do not forget to like and subscribe and i see you in the next video bye bye